another thing we all share, I'll just go into this quickly because I find this so interesting, is we got that go get thing. You know, everybody has a busy thing. Even women in my neighborhood who have nothing to do are booked for the week because <laughs> they do Pilates five times a week so that their pelvic floor is strong enough to be able to lift the carpet. <laughs> booked to the hilt, these people are. Booked. But, you know, again, that we wear them. That's our badge. So the reason we, again, the reason we can't stop going for it is, again, something that helped us survive a long time ago because the people that were the most driven, the people that were the most driven were the ones that survived. They found the food. They were the best foragers. And the chilled out ones died. So we still have this thing about, you know, the guys that are really driven. I mean, I know it isn't for food anymore, but basically it is to get, to get. And the thing about getting is there's a chemical in us that makes us do this. You know, again, there's no puppeteer up there. Uh, what we're, what's pushing us is this thing called dopamine, which is good because it got me up here and it makes you successful. But again, the problem is nobody can find the breaks. So once you get the hits, here's another problem. We get addicted to our own chemicals. Like I'm really high on adrenaline. I'll pack my bags when the car comes to pick me up for the airport. Because, you, you know, that reptilian thing feels really good. When I, like being late here gave me such a buzz. <laughs> that traffic was bad, but I was high. <laughs> People were waiting. So, um, <laughs> thanks for making me feel good. And same with dopamine. Like if it's not even the getting, you know, that's not, that's not what, what the dopamine does. It's the hunt. So that's why there's so many unhappy addicts. It's not about getting your high. It's about searching for the next one. So let's say you really, for the women, you really wanted Jimmy Choo shoe. You really want it. So you get one, finally. But the next thing, you're, you've still got it. You're still now looking for shoe-rich environments so that you can get another one. There's no, you'll just endlessly go until you go to a dinner party and a woman is wearing them. You'll gnaw her ankle off to get those shoes. It never stops. And whatever we want, you know, we want more. And magazines, by the way, know this. So they make a salvate for the net, like, you know, Sotheby's magazine. All, people that collect art, you know, they finally get an installation of some semen uh, with a cracker next to it. And they don't even, they want the next one. We just, that's the way we are.